guys, it's Mary. Welcome to back to welcome back to our channel XX Dying Hacks XX. Today's tutorial is going to be how to move text slash overlay uh, Camtasia Studio as you are seeing now on the screen. That's that is what we are going to create today. So yeah, let's just get started. You must go to clip in and import all the media that you want. Um, and host a parenthesis here. This is just going to be a tutorial for one overlay or like one text. But if you want me to make a multiple overlays, as you see, well, like. I was saying the title and all that, put in the comments down below so I can make that tutorial. So you first want to add your overlay that you have and just make it like as long as possible because um, if you want to put a lot of animation it's going to take a long time. So yeah, you can make your own like um, overlay on pitmonkey.com because that's like my favorite page to make overlays and all that because this creates uh, this page. So yeah, um, I don't know what I'm doing. But yeah, you can just make it. And also, a tip is that if you use a bigger do it as big as I ha as I have been doing this square. Then this is to prevent the image to get blurred. So yeah, um, it's uh if you want like the overlay to then appear here, um, just leave it aside and then go to visual properties, or you can go in more. Uh, if you don't have like this thing over here, you can just click on add animation and like you can say i i just want it to be here um while it goes just like making the circle movement and then you this mini ball or <laughs> this mini ball this circle that you're going to see um there is going it depending on how long do you want it there's the duration i'm going to do it like three seconds because i don't want it too long so then that's going to be the final look um and yeah it's really simple guys um then you just cannot, you, then you can, I don't know, animation, um, you just want to like, you may be saying like that, well, I just want to be here, well, just put it there, like that, and just move again the circle, so then this is going to be the end product, um, and it's really cool, um, I discovered this myself, like, I didn't need it, I didn't need to watch a tutorial, so I'm really proud of myself, because I, like, in the past, I investigated about this, but I didn't find a video that could help me. So one day I just was like, uh, I was just in Camtasia Studio, then I just started to do something in these two closer effects and visual properties. This caught my attention, so I just started to investigate about that. And closer, closer effects, I don't know exactly what it is, but I'm going to investigate it, and if it's something that can help you to make your videos more, like, professional and all that, I'm going to make a video of that, but uh, still, I don't know what it is, but I'm going to investigate. And yeah, if that is all. Um, make sure to thumbs up this video if you like it, subscribe, and comment down below any video request that you want us to do. So yeah, that's everything. Bye.